to the first unit in the curriculum, the foundational unit that helps establish enough Dakota language for all subsequent units to be carried out through immersion. This unit is also delivered in immersion, but is structured slightly differently because learners often need a lot more support at this level. There's no final project here. It's more of a game culminating. You will see that the lessons here are more heavily scripted and take a lot more care than the later lessons. That's because we really need to balance how much learners can be exposed to the language without feeling overwhelmed or lost. In the first lesson, we begin right away with an interaction. No introduction, no monologue at the beginning because it will overwhelm learners who are not able to understand. We then go through a series of interactions and games that allow learners to experience immediate, consistent, and real life success in communicating with one another. The language takes on meaning, it's fun, they do a lot of interesting things in each class period, so the pace is quick, and these strategies help us to overcome the vast majority of the anxiety, nervousness, frustration, and general trauma that comes up for language reclaimers. So these strategies seem fun and silly, but they really have a deeper purpose in making language something that is fun and empowering and not a site where people feel overly challenged to frustration or like they're identity or their validity is being threatened in any way. Most of the activities are games or short conversations that learners are able to have and we have designed those for you. You are welcome to use those. There isn't really a need for a ton of prep but I would recommend playing each of the games and working through each of the interactions either by yourself or with a willing partner before leading them because what's really important here is to make sure that we don't introduce too much complexity too quickly. We really want to keep things slow. We want to go back over things many, 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 many times so that everyone feels strongly confident that every single time they come to class, they are going to succeed in communicating in the language. Not just rote memorization, not just repeating after the teacher, but actually expressing themselves to someone in the language they're going to be understood and they're going to understand the response. That positive experience of communicating and interacting in the language is what is going to break through all the tension and nervousness and what is going to make them a motivated language learner who sticks with it for the subsequent unit. Essentially, by keeping the stakes very low and ensuring everyone's success in every single class session, we create a trust that they can move forward with us into more complex language without fearing that they will feel dumb, be embarrassed, fall behind, find out that they're not capable, etc. All those fears that people have. What we really, really emphasize for folks before they begin the course here, as much as is age appropriate for them, is that attendance is the necessary ingredient success. Being present in the classroom is what ensures success because if you're present we will help you. We also encourage folks to exercise a lot of patience and tolerance in the immersion environment because we know you won't understand everything the first time. So we assure them that we will be providing gestures, pictures, other visual supports, motions that will make sure that they understand and can participate we will not leave them hanging. We will not allow them to be embarrassed. Establishing that through this initial unit, which lasts from 10 to 20 class sessions, depending on how your program is scheduled, builds a lot of trust and positive community going into the subsequent units. It's worth doing this unit if you even have a few learners in your group who show through the pre-assessment that they are not yet at an intermediate level or um, are in the novice low, novice mid levels on the actful scale. This unit is so much fun and it allows learners to experience so much success and to show off what they know that almost no one minds repeating it even if they are more advanced. It's good for building community. If you enjoy it and you feel confident in it, students will meet you there.